listening to Youth Radio Rocks. Youth Radio, powered by By passion. passion. Right then, dear viewer, a lot of you are watching this because you might want to be a pilot or work your way up through the ranks in the Marines. This is Lenny Brown. Now, Lenny and I have a bit of a story because we first met, what are we saying, about 10 years ago, wasn't it? about 2008. 2008, where we flew in the rear end of the Lynx uh, for the Buckingham Palace. uh, Yeah, it was the centenary for the Falkland Islands. Uh, Not the centenary, rather the uh, 25-year Falkland Islands Memorial Flight good flight as well so let's talk about this beast behind us this is the mark 4 isn't it that's correct this is the merlin mark 4 um it's actually known now as the commando merlin and we're also going to embark it fairly quickly after we train the engineers and air crew to fly it um onto the queen elizabeth carrier for its yeah, of course, yeah. uh, maiden uh deployment over to the east coast of the united states so exciting times exciting times are you going to get behind the stick have a quick go uh, absolutely it's part of my job of course yeah, of course it is <laughs> nice jollies how does it compare to the Sea King? It's a strategic aircraft. So the Sea King had a great service life, um, but it was getting old and tired. Uh, This beast flies at over 200 miles an hour, normal cruise. I can lift over 20 guys in full kit, you know, at strategic ranges. For a contingent um, force that's at high readiness, you know, it's absolutely perfect. And of course, this is the maritime version. So it's got, you know, unique selling points. It's got a beefed up undercarriage that you can see. Um, it's got folding head and folding tail, so I can pack lots more punch in, in the Navy's shipping. Uh, and that means we get higher tempo uh, and we can poise wherever we like in the world to do intervention and all the way through to humanitarian aid operations. Multi-role, and it's got lots of uh, it's got lots of gizzets on there as well. You can see behind me the TI site, which is the black pod. It's got a great set of radios. The mission system is superb, uh, so it really reduces the workload of the air crew so they can fight the aircraft because we don't just fly onesies and twosies. Uh, we fly mass formation with uh, with all the Royal Marines in the back. How many crew is this? It's uh, four crew if we're doing uh, operations so two air crewmen in the back uh, and two pilots in the front okay so for the youngsters that are listening today if they wanted to be crewing something like this how would they go about it uh, pop down to your local royal navy recruiting office um, where you can either join the royal marines or the royal navy um, we've got a direct entry uh, and within a matter of months you could be flying something like this not that you're biased of course let's say the marines eh? yeah well if you want the tougher route then go for the <laughs> marines uh, but uh, it's just as rewarding Army Air Corps does exist, folks. <laughs> anyway, Lenny, it's always a pleasure and lovely to see you again. No, thank Thanks you very, very much. much for your time. Yeah, lovely to see you.